Okay, so guys, again with unlock. Okay, this time we want truth and one okay. <laughs> This time we want to unbreak <coughs> the Xiaomi Pon. Okay, this is <coughs> the Redmi 6A. Okay, and it has been brick. Okay. It's had a hard break, okay. And the problem is, if you want flash the phone, we must have um, we must have an Xiaomi Auto Notification account, okay. Not everybody has have that account, or we, we need to bring it to the Xiaomi Service Center. But this kind of phone. Will not have any guarantee, so you have to pay a lot for it. Okay, <coughs> okay. This one is uh, also <coughs> with this method. It doesn't have to pass the MMC. Okay, MMC need to remove the hardware. And it will be risky, and it will be risky and uh, not cheap. Okay, very expensive. Okay, this method you can also try it in the one that has been locked. That have a lock the loader. Okay, doesn't matter if it lock or unlock. Okay, this is for credit. I will write down in the description box. This method was created by a Dinoelec and. <coughs> Credit also to Chaos Master X Y Z Z and tutorial for the Yarpot Cough. Okay, <coughs> please check uh, the description box. Okay, okay, install. Okay, now we want to flash as usual. Okay, I will show you that it will not. Cannot flash it using the usual method. <coughs> okay, open this file and just uh, scan the file here yeah. and press download. Okay, we will try to. Okay, you can see cannot download it. <coughs> if you use the Xiaomi firmware, it also will ask for authentication file. Okay. It, always, it will be always fail. Okay, so we will use method. Okay. <coughs> okay, you can check the tutorial. The tutorial in my blog here. I will <coughs> link it in the description box. Okay. Thing to do is you have to install Python. Okay, I already installed it, but I'll show you how. Okay, I have Python in here. Okay, I'm gonna put it in the description link in here. <coughs> I'm not Python. Just the ARM64. Okay. I already installed, so it will be fun in this one. Okay, so you can select install now. <coughs> okay. And click next, and just follow the instruction. Okay. And the second one is we need to download this file. <coughs> uh, what is it? The PSD. Okay. This one. This one. Okay. Let's start this one. Like this. USB okay. 
and after it completed you need to check the launch is lot wizard okay <coughs> and then it will ask for filter select this one and next okay. and after this you need to push the volume down show you this one media tag and click the media tag and install okay Jadi install the driver after that you can close the apps okay we already installed so we cannot install it again okay <coughs> then and now after install the python and lead usb we can Install the bypass. Okay. First thing to do is let's open the SP Presto. Okay. I'm using this version. Sorry. I'm using this version. SP Presto 5.1916. Okay. It works in this version. Maybe. It also work in the latest version, but it won't work in the in the previous version, like this one, 5.1648. Okay, let's try this one and open it. <coughs> okay, and after we open, <coughs> make sure that you uncheck file and just click the click holder okay. <coughs> this is just for unbreak the device okay unbreak it means that the software is okay eh, sorry I mean the Android is fine but the boot loader is broken okay just click this one but if you want to flash all the file just click all Okay, I'll close this one. And now we want to open the command from here and open the bypass folder. Okay, and do it soon. Let me six, let me six, eight. <coughs> file the main the config and the paid payload okay so we need to run this command <coughs> we need to <coughs> uh, change the folder okay this is in the C and this is in the D so I'll copy the button here click OK type D if you have file in the default like I do okay this and type CD space oh, sorry type CD space and right click paste okay this one and then run this command okay Python main dot, dot pe and then uh, slash c empty okay. config rotation and space dash p space empty payload 
like this okay you can check my blog this python mine pc config okay this one and then <coughs> Just need to enter it. Sorry. Uh, yes, I mistyped it. <laughs> okay, you just can copy and paste it. <laughs> copy and paste it here. Okay. Uh, you can see it's waiting for the bootrom. Okay. So, yeah, all we have to do is. Uh, pull up and give up. Okay. As you can hear, <coughs> uh, sorry, try it again. Press enter, just uh, <coughs> pull them up and uh, okay, plug in cable, press pull them up. Hit enter on this command, press volume up and back the cable. Okay, you will see the screen. If it set the protection disable, we can continue to press this in the SP press door. Okay, now press this one and open the press door again. Now we want to go to the option menu here and option again. Go to the connection and make sure. It changed from the USB here to UART, okay. <coughs> and change the boat trap, okay. The highest is one, the nine thousand nine two x okay. Close this one, <coughs> and just click the install. You can see there is progress here, okay. Done. You can see. We check green button. It means that we have succeed. Close this one. And one for the cable and plug again the connector. Okay. We try to turn it on. Okay. Device is turning on. Redmi 6 series uh, and also the Redmi 6A Victus. Okay, you need the what is it called? You need the scatter folder, scatter file also. I will include it in the description box. Okay, so we are using this tutorial. We do not need to unshow me authentication account or replace the MMC, okay? <coughs> I hope you like this video. If you find it useful, please hit the like button. Okay, I have a lot of video tutorial about Android, especially booting. If you want to receive notification, I really like it if you hit the subscribe button. Okay. Thank you very much. Assalamualaikum.